Hopefully the lighting doesn't suck in this video. It's kind of getting dark, but it was really hot earlier, so I didn't want to record this when it was like hot outside. Uh, but I've been wanting to rotate like where I do my recording of that and stuff. And I do have some footage of the doggos. Um, I wanted to be able to put them in like a couple more videos, just because um, I did one video a while back of just them babies of them like taking part in a video it was like a it was a giveaway that i had one from uh, midnight owl here on youtube if you guys want to check it out see my cute little doggies um i lost one of them a couple of weeks back and uh it's been kind of it's been it's been really hard <laughs> i know that not everybody thinks of pets the same way or like bonds with their pets the same way but um, for me and my family, like, these dogs are, like, babies to us, so, um, also, I'm sorry if there's a little bit of wind getting picked up from the camera, it is pretty breezy right now, but, um, yeah, we've been dealing with that this past couple weeks, and I did do a post here, uh, I also posted on Twitter, that's my newest social media, if you guys would like to check that out, I know not that many people even have a Twitter. I didn't have one until like very recently. I think I made one like in 2013 and I never posted on it. But uh, yeah, I do have a Twitter now if you guys want to check that out. I'll leave actually all of my social media links. I have Twitter, Instagram, I have Twitch as well. I try to do live streams at least twice a week on Thursdays and Saturdays. Sometimes I want to be able to start doing like a bonus stream on Fridays, uh, but it just it depends on whether or not I can get like a lot of stuff done. I, I, I don't want to like compromise more time with family and like my pets to do more like social media stuff if I don't have to. But look at them. They were over here earlier but my mom just fed them again so <laughs> they're ravaging through their foods. And um, right now we're just like this has been this past two weeks i've been spending more time with them and just like appreciating them a little bit more like i bought them new tweet new treats and new toys and i'm thinking about buying them more toys because i don't know if they like the ones that they have because they're all getting kind of old so um i've been trying to find them like softer toys because when they were little we did buy them like kind of softer like the squishy toys and they would tear straight through them to get to the squeakers and now that they're like getting older and their teeth are getting a little bit more like fragile I guess um, it's just I can tell that it's easier for them to play with like those softer toys now also sorry if you guys are hearing other voices in the background like my neighbors are outside of their house too which is also kind of why I'm talking a little bit low you know um, but anyway uh, yeah so been dealing with that this past couple weeks it's been hard for me to really like come up with like new creative ideas I'm, i've been really trying to do stuff that's not like hauls and like fashion and consumerism and things like that but it's it's kind of hard to come up with like artsy kind of creative videos for me right now so i don't know if you guys want to give me some ideas if there's something you guys want to see me do other than like shopping videos and like stuff like that um i'm totally down to do it i was thinking because lately like my way of coping through things like a lot of stressful situations in life i noticed is actually through shopping <laughs> and i didn't want to say that like out loud i hate saying that like out loud and stuff but that's kind of become my thing um when i was younger i used to watch people do hauls and stuff like uh bethany moda and i'm trying to think of other creators but anywho um, I hope you guys are doing well. Um, thank you to everybody who comments on these posts. Um, it means a lot, like, being able to talk to people right now and just, like, you know, distract myself from everything that's going on. Uh, and then, 
with my dog, we had him cremated, okay? We, we as soon as I found him, a couple hours later, we waited to see when, like, the local, like, clinics and stuff were open, and, um, we went to take him to get cremated because we didn't want him to, like, start decaying and stuff. Like, I don't want to get too, like, graphic into it. Um, and... Ten days later, we went to go pick up his ashes, and I had thought I was okay. Like, the first couple of days, I was, like, really messed up. And as soon as I thought I was okay, we went to go pick up his his ashes and everything, and, like, everything just came up like it feels like a fresh, like, loss. And <laughs> my video, I mean, my voice is kind of starting to break up, so I'm not going to go too far into it, but, um, yeah, it's already been, like, a hard past couple of weeks. And on top of that, like, everything that's going on now with what happened to, like, uh, oh my gosh, George Floyd, I'm just, uh, my heart goes out to their fa his family, and I know he's getting the justice he deserves with what happened with the cop, how he got sentenced, um, I didn't memorize everything that, like, all the, like, the sentencings and stuff like that, because I... These kinds of, these are really hard topics for me to talk, like discuss on, and I don't do like news-related stuff on my channel because I suck at remembering facts and stuff. But my heart goes out to his family. Oh my God! Look, he looks so happy. Look at him. <laughs> but um, anyway, um, yeah, these are crazy. This is a crazy year. Um, I know, like. I don't want to say it's been the worst year because I feel like it could always be worse. Uh, but anyway, I hope you guys are doing better than I've been. Let me know about updates on you because I just enjoy talking to you guys in the comments and everything. And I hope you enjoyed this video of my little doggos. Um, I do have a lot of stuff <laughs> coming in from my coping mechanism of buying a bunch of like stupid crap that I don't need um, this past few weeks and don't know if you guys want to see that I do have <sighs> I placed a doll's kill order you guys had helped me uh, for those of you who saw it on Instagram thank you guys for helping me pick the top that I was going to buy but I, I wanted to try buying like bell bottoms and stuff so that came in. I haven't tried the bell bottoms on or anything. Um, I used to have problems with those kinds of things when I was younger because I'm short. I'm like five foot one, so uh, I feel like bell bottoms are they look better with girls who have like longer legs or who wear like platform boots and stuff like that. So I'm gonna see how I make that work or if it even fits me being five foot one with platforms on. I feel like it probably won't. But if you guys want to see that video um i have dolls kill stuff that came in i don't think i'll be buying from dolls kills again but i don't want to like say that and end up not keeping my word <laughs> because i also placed a kill start order which i only placed that order because i had a discount code i even said that in uh, the video i made about like my kill star like whether or not i'd buy from them again um I only bought stuff from either one of those two websites because I had a discount co code. The same thing goes with Fashion Nova and the other brands that I buy. I only ever buy stuff from these brands when I have some sort of like discount on their stuff because I think that their prices are kind of outrageous and when there's actually a discount code, it kind of brings it down to the price that not that should be charged because I did still pay quite a bit of money for like some of the stuff on Dolls Kill and Killstar. That's what I feel like these sales are starting to turn into, like Fashion Nova, their, their stuff is constantly on sale, like they've been having like 30% off sales since like the start of everything with quarantine and all that, so I don't know, I feel like the, the whole sale thing is just like a gimmick and they racked up the prices of these items and are giving you a sale on it just for like looks and to get you to buy stuff you're probably paying the price of how much they were going to charge for that item anyway but i've been suckered into buying shit so if you guys want to see that video 
uh, of me doing like maybe like a collective haul because I don't want to do constant hauls on my channel or maybe do it like a style lookbook with all the the summary stuff that I bought recently um, I will definitely do that video um, just let me know what you guys want to see I, I really want to try to do like artsy like kind of crafty related videos but I just haven't had any sort of I don't know, I haven't had any good ideas that came to mind. Like, nothing that I wanted to actually do. I thought about trying, like, some, uh, like, uh, acrylic pour videos and stuff like that. But I don't know. I feel like those video ideas have been written out already. <laughs> I'm trying to get a picture of his face, but he, he keeps turning away from me. Look at him. This fancy, fancy cell. This fancy chihuahua. But, um... I'm trying to come up with ideas and it would be awesome if you guys had any uh, ideas for me as well um i i do want to do a paranormal kind of like story time video and talk to you guys about like that and there's another topic that i want to talk about it's kind of like been brought back to light this past couple of weeks on twitter um that i found like this girl being very disrespectful um it's kind of a subject that i just wanted to just address in this video no, not in this video in a video so if you guys want to see that let me know uh, but yeah uh, I'm hoping to get back into the groove of creating more like content like I normally would but I might need a little bit of time but of course I just wanted to do this video because I felt like like a normal video wasn't right for everything that's going on right now so yeah, but I hope you guys are doing well. I probably said that a couple times already. And um, I look forward to creating more content for you guys once things get a little bit more like back to normal in my little neck of the woods. But uh, anyway, I hope you guys have a good one and I will see you guys hopefully very, very soon. Bye. Come here. Come here. Come here, baby. Baby. Whoa, Bobby, come here.